not in the wildest dreams because, you know, you, we always said, oh, Denise, you know, she's going to play for me and she's going to play for me. But, you know, one, again, for to have the first match to, to be able to compete against my daughter, our, you know, my father who passed away, our number one fan for Denise and I, he would have been so proud of it because this was such a, you know, it's, it's not about the wins and losses, to be honest with you. It was about, you know, just the, the atmosphere, you know, how much this match meant to, you know, both of us and to my family and to, to this tennis community, mm -hmm. to be able to see, you know, just such a great role model for, for the kids, Denise. And for me, for my first opportunity to have that, it was fantastic. It was uh, definitely very special. Um, I think heading into the week, you know, I kept saying that it, it wasn't about the win or the loss. And, you know, it just we did lose. And obviously, you know, I'm upset about that. But what I take back from today is not, you know, not the win or the loss. Um, Kim, my opponent, played exceptionally well. Um, so I think, it, you know, the memory of the intensity of the match and the excitement and the emotions and um, I guess you know if, if I'm going to lose to anyone I'm glad it's my dad's first head coaching win. Not easy I, it's but I'll tell you especially at this match having uh, have the spotlight I could not for anybody else to share the spotlight 